guys today I'm going to talk about the several types of math students we encounter in high school now I don't mean to be offensive at all or ungrateful it's just for fun and any similarity between this and real life is a mere coincidence let's begin number one the frustrated seal now this is the student who is always in rage mode seriously he could have just won the lottery or found a baby panda he would still complain about math every single time god why did the teacher put this coefficient equal to 3 square root of 2 over 4 pi couldn't it be like 1 or something yeah, I definitely think it's the... I, yeah, I saw him. I definitely did. I don't know. Jason, can you please stop chatting with your partner? I am trying to teach something here, okay? I wasn't talking. It's always me. Oh my god, I am so stupid. I definitely knew how to do exercises 2 and 3. I just forgot what the teacher taught us last week. Oh my god, this teacher sucks. She doesn't know how to explain. I don't understand anything. I suck at math and I hate it. I don't know what the hell this is about. But have you actually tried to understand it for more than five minutes? Do you even study? No, but how am I supposed to study if I don't understand this? Number two, the cute flower. Now, this is the student who has no idea about what's happening in the class, never opens the book, but pretends to be a responsible, attention-paying angel. So now, we must divide 2x and 1 by 2 to get this. Oh, so when we have something like that, we must divide by two, right? Exactly, Peter! I am glad you were paying attention! Hey, teacher, can you come here, please? I mean, I've tried to do number three, but I just don't know how to do it. Could you help me out? Miss, miss, um... My mom bought me this book. Do you think it is good to prepare for the exam? Number three, the parasite. Usually, this student is very popular and ish, but isn't exactly into trigonometry and numbers. So, before the test, he pretends he's the best friend of all the students with good grades. Seriously, he may never speak to them ever, but when that test is coming... Hey man, I like that coat! Can you please solve number one? Hello, genius! I heard you won that um, competition, so you must be like really good at math. Uh, I mean, you can, you can, you know how to do this, right? Could you like perhaps um, tell me? Oh, I have nothing against you. I just don't like you. Number four, the calculator addict. This is that kind of student who writes every single formula in his calculator as if he had no brain and no memory. And usually during math class, he's not paying attention. He's playing Tetris or Super Mario or whatever the act he has on his graphical calculator. And so we conclude that the area of a triangle is the base multiplied by its height all divided by 2. Okay, better write that down. The area of a rectangle is equal to width times length. Oh, hold on a second. I must definitely have that too. And finally, number five, the misunderstood. 
This is that guy or girl who's really into math and wanna study math at university. So he or she constantly hears things like this. I heard you wanna study mathematics in college, um, so you wanna be a teacher, right? Wait, you like math? Like, you want to do math in your life? But when will you exactly use algebra? Hey, you're good at math, right? Can you help me out? Cause like, my tablet doesn't have the calculator app. So, um, do you know how much is 37% out of 4,465? God. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you relate to it or know anyone that does, then please share it with your friends. And if you think that I forgot to mention some kind of student that you encountered at high school, then leave it in the comments below, because I will sure read it and have a good laugh. Bye!